All right, so today we're gonna to talk about nutrition. Tons of things we can chat about with nutrition, but one I'm gonna to address today is how many times a day should you eat and what times of the day should you eat? Something that gets really confusing, I know one of the most common things we see with clients in our studio is people missing meals all the time. And that's something that we want to avoid. What I'm gonna to do today is just go over a big overview of when you should be eating, how you should be eating, Everyone's going to be slightly individual, but in general, this is something that is, has proven successful for so many of our clients and people that I just know have been in the industry over 20 years and I've seen it work time and time again. A lot of people say, well, I'm different, I'm different. Slightly, but if you're only eating once or twice a day, it's not going to cut it in terms of weight loss, energy, performance. One of the most common questions I get asked is how often should I be eating and at what times of the day should I eat? Pretty simple question, yet there are so many misleading things out there. And while everyone's a little bit different, I'm gonna give you some really good guidelines to follow that work for our clients time and time again, and it leaves some flexibility for, uh, for various people and their, their individual needs. So we've all heard breakfast is the most important meal of the day. We wanna make sure we have that. I usually tell clients, within 20 to 60 minutes of waking up, you need to have your first meal. Now, it doesn't have to be anything huge. It could be something small. That's okay, put some food in your body. Food is your energy that's going to get there. Regard, like We won't even talk about what to eat at this point. Just put food in your body 20 to 60 minutes after waking up. A lot of people say, oh, I eat breakfast every day, but the, the meal is not actually until two to three hours after they wake up, which isn't breakfast. That should be your second meal. So I'm gonna do a little diagram here for you. So right here, just call that uh, waking up. We draw a line for the day, this is going to bed. So right here, got breakfast. Throughout the day, every three to four hours, you should be having some food, putting it in your body. That's giving your body regular energy, regular number of calories, and what we wanna do is your day should just look like this. And maybe a little snack down here. So you probably heard four to six times a day, four to five times a day, four to um, five to six times a day. There are lots of different things, but generally most people are up for approximately the same amount of time. And if we start getting into the sleep, that's a whole other video, but basically every three to four hours throughout the day. Now, some people, if they're eating little smaller portions and their metabolism is going a little faster, might be able to eat every three hours. If you're a little slower on the metabolism, and uh, you're having larger meals, you may be able to go four hours. These can all be the same size meals or maybe lunch, breakfast, and dinner can be a little bit bigger. We call these snacks in here. They can be, uh, they can be just small, um, little tiny ones. I actually tend to go pretty equivalent size, four equivalent size meals throughout the day and maybe a little snack towards the evening. But uh, ideally, the number of calories you're taking in it should be larger here and tapering down towards dinner because when you go to bed over here, you don't need a lot of energy overnight. Most people, this is their biggest meal of the day and the, the meal looks like this or the day looks like that. They don't have much breakfast. They have an okay lunch and by dinner they're starving. They have a massive meal and then they go to bed and their body says, oh, thank you for the calories. I'm just going to start as body fat. So. Try and eat with the inverted pyramid regular times throughout the day. Pretty simple tips for you. Hope that helps.